Hey, there you are. Are you flirting with me? <laughs> if you have to ask, I'm clearly out of practice. Well, when we've got time, you'll have to let me practice. You know, I've just been sitting here thinking. Uh-oh. Okay, hit me with it. So those Cerberus scientists, they were good people. What do you mean? I mean, Dr. Cole and her team, they seem like... like good people. Knowing that, what do we do? I mean, what if they're more like them, trapped inside Cerberus, struggling to get out? Tell me what you think we should do. I don't know, Shepard. These are the hard calls. I mean, the decision to sacrifice the one for the many, the choice to leave someone behind, till you're in that moment. I... So, yeah, you know, I don't know. We don't have time to dwell on it. If people come to us, we help them when we can. But the war is our primary focus. Of course. There are people all over the universe that need our help. The faster we take down the Reapers, the more we can save. So the scientists that put you back together, that saved your life, they were good people. They were professionals. I didn't know them all. And the elusive man? Was he a good person? Once? Ever? Well, he gave me what I needed to stop the Collectors. Right, exactly. But so you never saw this coming from them? From him? Sorry. I'm not sure what I want you to say here. I guess I'm just looking for some sort of insight on the elusive man. Something. Does it matter what he was, Caden? What good he may have done in the past? He's become power hungry. He's deluded and wrong. But this? No. I never saw this coming from him. Mm. Okay. Well, thanks, Shepard. I'm glad we could talk about this. Meanwhile, you should find a way to take your mind off things. I know. Joker did ask me to give him some poker tips. He keeps losing his shirt to James. Good luck with that. Joker has a terrible poker face. <laughs> Great. Well, I like a challenge. Sira. You bet. <laughs>